Scorpio, welcome back. I hope you're all doing well. I know we're probably all anxious for a reading here, so we're going to go ahead and get started. For those of you brand new, welcome to our Shacy Spiritual Family. We hope you become a part of our family as well by hitting the notification bell and subscribing. It's absolutely free, hitting the like button if you enjoy these messages you are about to receive. Let's see what's going on, Scorpio. I'm going to start out with the fortune messages here. Let's see what they are. And then I'm going to pull a couple of energy oracles as well. Let's see what's happening. So for those of you brand new, this is how it works. I'm going to dig so much deeper into Scorpio's energy. Whether you're cross-watching or not, you will know how this resonates for you. So take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Definitely don't force any messages. This could happen in the future for some of you here. It may be happening right now because it is a general read. Check your moon rising Venus signs. I'm also going to check your energy here on the traditional tarot, mutual energies between you and who you're dealing with and uh, their energy over here, but it can be vice versa. be a combination of both your energies. It can intermix, be all of yours or all of theirs. Generally, I find I pick up our person's energy more than our own, which is exactly what we want to know, most of us. I'm going to pull some romance angel messages as well. We're going to start digging, and I'm going to do your overall energy. So whether you're single or whether you're thinking about somebody, however this resonates for you, you will know. Okay, I will try to read it always for you so that... Um, everybody understands the messages but sometimes again it may not be your message right now but it might be in the future okay so you need to remember that let's get started first message dog close up pleasure with a close friend so you could have a really close friend of yours you're just kind of getting together with having a good time here this can be somebody that's turned romantic here for you or not here it can be but it can just be simply going out and enjoying uh, time with your friends here for some of you Ooh, very nice. Not surprising in a Scorpio reading. Psychic ability. Spirit wants you to trust your intuition here. Keep your eyes wide open, Scorpio. But I feel we all do that. For those of you brand new, I'm also a Scorpio. And for those of you revisiting and for your constant support, you know, I can't, words can't express on how. Um, I appreciate you all very much for staying tuned and and for um, checking out these readings. And I'm so happy to hear from many of you that they've been resonating so much. It's fantastic. It really makes my day. So keep those messages coming if they're resonating for you. I definitely want to hear from you in the comment section. I read every one. I can't respond to everyone, okay? But I do try. Honor and respect will come to you. So Scorpio, many of you are being very highly respected right now uh, because you have... Um, stayed in high vibration many of you even though things have been really tough lately for most of us here I feel like you've managed to stay grounded you've managed to stay stable and you've managed to stay focused and continue to work hard no matter what challenges come your way so spirit is saying honor and respect will come to you for that okay awesome all right let's get started I'm gonna pull the uh, angel tarot here for our overall energy let's see what's going on angels and spirits for Scorpio Sun Moon rising and Venus what are the newest messages for August in the extended if this resonates for you I will continue your reading for another plus or minus 15 minutes you can choose to purchase that or not okay that's down in the comment section as well as the description area it's a lot less expensive than a personal reading but if this resonates for you, you may wish to take advantage of that I will do the pendulum bonus in that okay so I'll ask spirit questions about your person specifically or who's coming towards you Okay, whether you're waiting for a soulmate, whether you're hoping for a soulmate, whatever, I will be uh, asking Spirit probably about four questions, give or take. And I will also uh, dig into the month ahead. So we'll sneak peek into September in the extent. That'll be, again, available below in the comment section as well as the description area. Let's see. You will have a choice, hopefully, if there's enough room on Vimeo between Vimeo and Gumroad. Whatever your viewing source pleasure you prefer. Let's see what's going on for Scorpio. What are the newest messages that we need to hear for August? What's the newest messages? Wow, that I can feel that. Okay, Scorpio, there's going to be some challenges coming your way here. Mm -hmm. But again, not surprising. You know, there could be conflict with others or somebody that you're dealing with, place of work. This can be competition to do with love it can be disagreements with family or friends this can be whoever you're dealing with maybe they're going through different challenges right now okay you or whoever you're thinking about here now keep in mind that these challenges are temporary okay continue to honor and respect yourself and stay in high vibration and you will do just fine spirits telling you to trust your intuition here okay 
Wow. You could be dealing with a Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries, or somebody that's really fired up here, taking the action, getting through challenges, but willing to take the lead on something. So Scorpio, you could be taking on the energy of this King of Fire, being very focused, being very driven, going after what you want. You know, this is somebody who is single, doing awesome, a leader, could own your own business here getting through the challenges, getting through the bumps and bruises, either in business or in a connection here. Mm -hmm. Or you could be dealing with someone who is in a very high vibration of taking the lead here. They're focused, they're dead focused, they're independent, they're financially secure here. Okay, they could be self-employed. Again, flip it, could be you, could be somebody you're dealing with. But this is about being very financially stable, secure, uh, could be self-employed, own business here, a boss, a leader, somebody who's extremely motivated, okay? Also somebody who is very passionate, somebody who's very magnetic here, getting through the challenges here. Now, there could be competition for this king of fire, could be you. And again, it doesn't have to be. Whatever it is, there's challenges coming here. But somebody's cutting through it. No problem. It's like, I'm taking the lead on this. I've got it. I'm single. I'm doing well. You know, I feel like, yeah. Okay, wow. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, somebody's taking the lead here, Scorpio. We've got Scorpio Pisces Cancer energy here. It's like somebody is taking the lead here fighting off whoever is in the way here it's like i'm single i'm financially independent it's like if you don't like what i'm doing too bad here okay you know i have certain regrets of how things are turning out i'm kind of disappointed on how things are turning out here but i'm willing to fight the fight here because this is somebody who knows what they want they're a go-getter and they're going after it no matter what and i feel like Either Scorpio, somebody's wanting to come in and take you out here and they're willing to fight off any competition or vice versa. It could be both of you here. But Spirit says that you're going to fall in love with somebody, possible proposal or taking a relationship to the next level here. Okay, I feel like, you know, somebody may be like really regretting how things have turned out here with you or they're just very disappointed on the fact that they've had to... Um, fight with others in order to come towards you or again vice versa this could be challenges between you and them could be some kind of a power struggle quite possibly here but you know this is the most romantic night in the deck regardless it's kind of like i'm taking the lead on this you know i'm gonna i want to take you out let's go ahead it's like I'm, I'm willing to get over the challenges no matter what somebody's willing to get through this because they they feel this pull towards you here. <laughs> the high priestess. Interesting, because we have psychic ability here. Spirit wants you to trust your intuition and divine guidance here, or this is your person. They may also be a high priestess, trusting their guidance and intuition here to come towards you, to take the action here, uh, fighting off any challenges, or if there's any competition, they're willing to do that. Okay, this is somebody that's willing to take the lead here, Scorpio, and Spirit's telling you to have the patience here. And, you know, whatever you do, yeah, go ahead and um, stay positive, stay focused. And you need to keep your eyes wide open here before acting. I feel like this is your person, but it could be you. It's water energy and fire energy. If you have strong water, fire, earth in your chart here. There may have been, for some of you here, there's definitely others involved here, whether that's family or friends or whether this is place of work. It's like, no matter what, we're, we're trusting our intuition to overcome these challenges here because with or without my friends, my family, coworkers, whatever this is, I can make it on my own because, you know, I'm a leader. I'm, I'm taking charge of my life. I'm financially independent. I don't need anybody in my life in terms of being secure. Okay, do you understand what I'm saying? This is a leader. They, they take the lead on everything. Let's go ahead and get some Flaming Roses confessions for Scorpio. What are the Flaming Roses confessions? What would our person, our soulmate, like to say to Scorpio or whoever Scorpio is dealing with now in the near future? And again, Scorpio, this could be you, you know, taking the action. 
being a leader, self-employed, doing awesome financially here. You're magnetic. You're on fire here. Trusting your intuition. You are the high priestess. So no matter what, you are very, very psychic. Spirit's telling you to trust your intuition to guide you in making any upcoming decisions here. Let's see what's going on. What are the confessions from our person of interest for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for August 2021? What are the newest messages for Scorpio? <laughs> Waiting on you to forgive me. I promise I can change. So perhaps somebody you're dealing with, Scorpio, wants you to forgive them. They want you to know that they're trying to change certain things, maybe about themselves here. Maybe there was conflict between the two of you here. Like I said, I feel like some of you, not all of you, have been kind of maybe bumping heads. Because this is somebody who's very fiery, very feisty, very magnetic. They come off as Mr. Suave or Miss Suave. Again, not gender specific here. This is somebody that is very self-assured, very confident, very much um, independent here. How can you love me after I screwed everything up with our connection? Okay, so this person feels like they really messed up this connection here. And they're wondering how you can still love them, you know, unconditionally after all this. And they're trying to make changes, I feel, in their life here that they feel bad for ha perhaps for the disagreements or how things went down. But I feel they want to come and take you out and they may be keeping this to themselves pres presently or trying to trust their intuition in order to come towards you here. Um, trying to figure it out, Scorpio, is what I'm seeing. Let's go ahead and get a couple of romance angels for Scorpio. What are the messages, please? I will dig deeper into the extended into September and the high priestess. Is that someone keeping secrets, keeping their feelings to themselves, or wanting to come in and date you and not really telling you right now? They're trying to trust their intuition on whether or not to come in towards you here to make things right, perhaps, because they're missing you, you're missing them what I'm getting here let's go ahead we're going to do pick a card with the romance angel so your first message Scorpio is your strongest message your second your second and your third your third but you're meant to hear all three messages for Scorpio please angels and spirits for Scorpio Scorpio there we go all right are you ready first message for Scorpio what's our messages please trust this situation is calling for you to have faith so spirit wants you to have faith and again trust your intuition Scorpio here you need to have faith, which I feel most of us Scorpios do. We don't give up too terribly easy, do we? No. Next message for Scorpio. Very soon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. So Spirit, again, is telling you, you know, to trust your intuition before acting, before making a decision here, okay? It's okay to... Um, trust your divine guidance you know it never steers you wrong and the moment that we don't trust our intuition it seems like we have regrets doesn't it okay so this can be that you know somebody honors and respects you um respects the fact that you uh stand up for yourself even scorpio here is what i'm getting here because they may have come off as this very magnetic very smoking hot person who's financially independent and driven here and they may have kind of like been over the top maybe or maybe this was you either way it's kind of like <laughs> i want to come in and take a scorpio out here i need to figure this out i'm keeping this to myself right now here this can be somebody that you know um again owns their own business you may not have met this person scorpio they could be watching you here okay this may be somebody that you haven't been interested in or you have been interested in but you may be you know um you've been otherwise occupied here i feel at work maybe working hard on your own business here very dead focus this could be you wow it is safe for you to love open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all spirit wants you to know that you can trust this okay and that you will need to make decisions soon if this person comes in and wants to take you out here spirit wants you to know it's safe and for you to open up your heart okay and you will need to make some decisions this could have been somebody in your life that really messed up here um they could have again come off very kind of brash kind of bold kind of maybe over the top here maybe you didn't trust them 
you know, that they were real or whatever the case. Maybe you thought that, you know, oh, okay, they've, they're letting me know they have all these other options or maybe they do Scorpio and you're kind of like, no, nope, not interested or you weren't sure, you didn't trust it. Okay, again, or vice versa. Let's get going. Let's see what's going on for Scorpio. Angels and spirits, what's the newest message that us Scorpios need to hear for highest good for August 2021 for Scorpio? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for Scorpio. What are the newest messages that we need to hear for our highest good for Scorpio for August 2021? What are the newest messages we need to hear? What are the newest messages we need to hear? And don't go anywhere because we're still going to pull the energy oracle. So stay tuned here. And of course, the mutual energies. Shacy Prism deck is available at shacy.com if you're interested in that. Wow, we got the Queen of Swords. She could be dealing with a Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, but this Queen is somebody that cuts people out. This Queen demands respect and honesty and nothing but here. Tell me the truth and nothing but the truth because this Queen's been hurt before. They've been through it. They've gone through some experience. They've gone through heartache. And they're wise. They're very, very wise. This is somebody that is thinking and with their head over heart here. Queen of Swords. Okay, Scorpio, this could be you or whoever you're dealing with. It's kind of like I, I don't have all the answers here. I don't know what's going on. I'm in the dark. I'm not kind of comfortable with making any decision right now. I've got my sword up just in case I need it because I don't know what's going on here. I don't know. I'm in the dark. I've got my blindfold on. And so I feel like, Scorpio, you don't feel comfortable really out and out making a choice or decision right now because you're kind of like, what the heck is going on? I don't know what's going on. Somebody has been either keeping secrets from you or keeping quiet or, you know, just it's kind of like you don't know what to trust I'm getting here. Or this is your person. Again, it can go vice versa. Let's keep going here. What's going on with Scorpio's person of interest, Scorpio's soulmate? Whoever is on their mind now or in the near future who's coming towards Scorpio. What are their intentions towards Scorpio? What are their feelings towards Scorpio? What might be hidden that us Scorpios need to be aware of for Scorpio? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for August 2021. What are the newest messages we need to hear from our soulmate now or in the near future who's coming toward us? What are their intentions? What might be hidden that we need to be made aware of for Scorpio? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. August 2021. What are the newest messages from our person for Scorpio? What do we need to know? Leave me comments. Let me know if this is resonating for you. Goodman, Usagi, thank you. Thank you so much for constantly supporting our Shacy spiritual family. You know, I really appreciate you so, so very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for Scorpio. What's going on, please? Angels and spirits. What do we need to know? What's going on with our soulmate now or in the near future? What do us Scorpios need to know about our person of interest? Wow, Scorpio, beautiful. <laughs> Gotta like that. Hello, sun. This is the sign of Leo, but the sun represents growth, honesty, clarity, things coming out in the open, success, abundance, happiness, growth, harmony, peace. Very nice. Very nice energy right there. Why is the sun here? Clarify the sun for us Scorpios. Clarify the sun for us Scorpios. So if anything's been hidden here, Scorpio, if you've been in the dark about a few things, I feel like things are going to come out into the light here. Okay, trust your intuition here. OMG. You've got a knight of wands and a knight of pentacles. You could have more than one opportunity here with a fire sign and an earth sign, but I feel more like... This is the same person because we've got that fire energy again here. I feel like this is somebody that is wanting to take the action but going slowly. They're coming towards you very, very slowly here because this is somebody that is excitable, a young energy. It's kind of like I'm not fully ready now. I want to take the action but I'm going slowly towards bringing things out into the open here because I'm trying to trust my intuition here, okay, because there has been challenges here. Um, it can be that, again, this is somebody who is a leader of a business, a self-sufficient independent, so they're otherwise tied up here financially or in a business sense here. Let's keep going. That all wanted to come out at once. Let's get the mutual energies. What's going on for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for August 2021? What are the newest messages? How, is, how are things going mutually between Scorpio and their soulmate now or in the near future? 
what are the newest messages? How is Scorpio and their soulmate mirroring one another in terms of their hopes, dreams, wishes, and fears for August 2021? For Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for Scorpio. What are the newest messages? Don't forget to check out Shacy.com if you wish to do so. That would be awesome. Check out the reviews. I welcome you to go check that out. I just love my repeat clients. They're so awesome. And I love getting to know you on a one-to-one -one basis. It's fantastic. Check out the Facebook page. But make sure you don't get the wrong Facebook page. The link is down below in the description area. For those of you that have joined the other Shacy Tarot, that's something that Facebook did. I didn't ask them to. And they really kind of messed me up there. I have the other page. So check that out if you wish. And there's also Instagram. Look at that. So marriage, tradition, and commitment is on both of your minds. And we have the Knight of Cups. So you have three knights here, Scorpio. One who's romantic, one who is driven, who is passionate, and one who is very stable, very grounded, and moves very slowly. So again, you could have more than one opportunity here. You could. Or this could be the same person. They're wanting to sweep you off your feet. They're wanting it to be solid. And they have a high attraction to you. And they're wanting to take the action. But they're coming towards you slowly. Okay? Towards marriage. They want something long term here. You both do. It's in your mutual energies. Okay? So you need to support one another here. Spirit is saying. Um, you're both wanting to support one another. Both wanting long term happiness here. And success here. Wow, what was I just saying? Okay, so there needs to be some communication here. With that sun, though, I feel like somebody is, again, taking the action. It's just that they're they're going slowly here. I feel towards stability with you. So you may see them starting to take the action a little bit more, a little bit more, but kind of slowly. This is going to be kind of in and out, Scorpio, which I know we don't like that. We... <laughs> but spirit saying it's safe for you to love and you can trust spirit wants you to have faith trust your intuition what is your intuition telling you about this connection okay so you may be both a bit confused here because there's certain choices that you have to make but this is a choice in love this is wow very nice this is a spiritual connection scorpio this has been coming up a lot okay some of you could be dealing with a gemini here but there are, there's a lot of choices to make, not just in love, but overall. And I feel like it has, you know, a lot to do with what direction do I go? You know, there's a few things that need to be worked out. The communication needs to happen here because there's so many different decisions to make. It's kind of like, I feel like your person or you, Scorpio, is kind of like, I don't know what's going on, so how can I make any decisions or choices? So I feel like you're a little bit guarded right now because you're not sure what's going on. And Spirit says there needs to be communication here about the choices here while you're making a decision and a choice in love here in order to... Um, make a, a right decision here there needs to be that communication so let's get a couple energy oracles here before we head over to the extended let me know again if this is resonating don't forget to hit that like button it's so important to ha have others hear these messages okay it's truly appreciated i love bringing you these complimentary readings i love reading your comments definitely check out the community page Let's see what's going on for us Scorpios. What are the messages, please? Who or what is affecting Scorpio's energy for August 2021? What are the newest messages for us Scorpios? What are the newest messages? Who or what is affecting Scorpio's energy or their person here? OMG Scorpio. This has come out in every single reading. For those of you, you know, that are constantly here, constantly watching our readings here, how often has this come up? How often? I want you to write in the comment section. This is like the fifth time. I don't know. I've lost track. That's amazing. Definitely somebody wants to take action. So I think that you're going to feel like somebody's taking a bit more action. I mean, five of wands, king of wands, nine of earth here. It's like this is an action taker. This is somebody that takes the lead. I feel like there is, um, that's too many cards. I feel like there's, you know, some rivalry here. But somebody is taking the lead on that. Okay. They're going after what they want. They're trusting their intuition. Let's see what's going on. We'll see in the extended if they're overcoming the challenges. I feel like they're going to take the action regardless here. But this is why somebody I feel is, is in and out of your life here is what I'm getting. Okay. I feel like you have no idea what's going on. You're just completely guarded. Door to spirit. Okay. So your person or you Scorpio. I feel this. You've already. You already have the door open to spirit. You're already highly intuitive and psychic. You are. 
um, this could be your person. Maybe they're opening that door. They're seeing the light. They're seeing things differently here. Okay, they're wanting to take the action. They're seeing you as their spiritual gift, spiritual partner, spiritual connection here. Okay, because this is the divine trying to bring two people together. So choices and decisions have to be made. And I feel like somebody's taking the action to do that. They're opening that door. They're taking the action here. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't make this up, Scorpio. Door to romance, door to spirit. So to get to the door to romance, you have to open the door to spirit. You have to be willing to let that sun shine in. You have to illuminate everything. You have to go after what you want. You have to take the action. So somebody's taking the action to trust their divine guidance to open that door to romance with you. They want to take you out here. They want to romance you. They, Wow, Scorpio, this is beautiful. Very nice energy. Okay, let's see. I was, I was going to stop, but I'm not going to stop. I want to pull the Kipper deck. Now, these can be really loud when I'm shuffling, FYI. So cover your ears, Scorpio. Are you ready? Okay. Who or what is affecting Scorpio's connection now or in the near future for Scorpio? Summoning rising and Venus. What are the newest messages we need to hear for Scorpio for August 2021? What are the newest messages we need to hear? What's going on for us Scorpios? Who or what is affecting our energy, our connections here? What are the messages we need to hear for Scorpio for August 2021? courtship oh my gosh Scorpio didn't I just say that we had the knight of cups and now we have courtship here knight of wands knight of pentacles this is somebody that wants to court you the old-fashioned way this is somebody that <laughs> wants to um, not only take you out but they want something stable long term they want to go slow but they're also passionate here they want to um, treat you right it's, this is somebody who's kind of old-fashioned kind of sweet here again this could be you Scorpio but I feel this is you having your sword up I'm getting this is you and I'm getting that you're dealing with somebody with strong earth and fire. This is why they're hot, cold, hot, cold, hot, cold, because they're they're kind of excited, but then they slow themselves down so they can stay steady and because they know that slow and steady wins the race. They're trying to stay focused. I feel here that they're a leader or something, a boss, something of, of again, their own business or they um, they could be a CEO of a company or again, it's it's just like. It's like they come in, they say a few things, they make sure that everything's okay, and then they go back off to work. You know, it, it's really <laughs> kind of drives you crazy, Scorpio. So you've got your guard up here because you're like, I've got my blindfold on, like what the heck is going on here? You know, so you're not really trusting and spirit's telling you here to have faith. It's right here. Trust your intuition here, okay? Trust your intuition here, okay? I feel this is somebody that is just... <laughs> Hot and cold, hot and cold, and it's because they're just making sure you're still there. <laughs> We've got a very masculine energy here, Scorpio. So for many of you, you're dealing with a very um, high testosterone <laughs> person, <laughs> Scorpio, who is wanting to take the lead here. They want to be the leader of this connection. They want to take the lead. Okay, so if there's a power struggle here, Scorpio, that could be what's, what happened in the past or that could be. But anyways, let's see. Okay, so they may have been wearing a mask before and now they want to show you their true authentic self. They want to court you, but they're kind of just putting their feelers out here. Again, you know, I feel like this is somebody who's being spiritually guided because we have here the lovers here, which is, you know, basically let's put our egos, egos aside here, you know, and take the action here. I'm opening the door to spirit. I'm trusting my divine guidance. I'm opening the door to romance, but I need to come in and I need to, I feel like they're, they're putting their feelers out Scorpio to see if maybe if you're still interested here. Okay. And, um, they want to, they want to do things right here. The old fashioned way. I feel this is somebody again, that's a boss or a leader here. And again, for you, Scorpio, this could be you. Okay. But I feel this is your person here. I feel like you have no idea what's going on and you're a little mistrusting here. And they want to promise you here that they messed up before. They may have been, been wearing a mask is what I'm getting here. Spirit saying it's safe for you to love here. Open your heart. Don't doubt it. And, you know, they messed things up. They feel disappointed here. I feel they have some regrets here. 
but I feel like secretly they want to come in and they're putting their feelers out to see if you're still interested. Let's dig deeper in the extended. Again, I'm going to pull the pendulum. I'm going to ask Spirit three or four questions here. We're going to focus on September. We're going to find out why the High Priestess is here. High Priestess is a keeper of secrets, but it's also about keeping silent, just kind of like maybe feelings or the fact that they want to come in and romance you here. Um, I'm also going to check into the mutual energies and find out you know where this knight of pentacles is going and of course your energy scorpio if this is you which i feel it is we're going to find out if you get out of the dark here i feel you will with the sun there but let's start digging so scorpio if this is where you leave me i wish you so much happiness so much success and you know what the sun there coming i feel like you can't lose scorpio really truly but let's start digging okay so for those of you brand new it's in the comment section for the link as well as a description area. Remember to check out the right Facebook page where you see the latest and the greatest postings there. You will see they're up to date. Okay, so you will have a choice between Vimeo again and Gumroad to view your extended if you wish to check that out. Stay happy, healthy, and safe. Much love, much light, and I will see you all again real soon. Namaste.